gates are back, and they fired away. Awkward start. Gnarly jumps onto stable companion Happy Days, who have to take its medicine and race from near the back of the field. Turbo 20, one of the first to break. Sound of the Sea at the outside is positively ridden. Levita Loka got a good break and is right there. Mauritius Kestrel likewise. Then comes Crimson Comet, who hugs the rail, sharing fifth with All Out for six. Then we go a length and a half back to Stated, who races at the outside of Gnarly. Then two lengths away to Word World. Happy Days, blue and white colours, is racing a good ten lengths off the leader and is green through the crossover. Then came War of Hearts and Priceless Pearl races at the end of the field as they make their way towards the final 700 metres and Turbo 20 ended up in front, probably defaulted to the lead with Sound of the Sea racing about a length away in second. Then comes La Vida Loca at the rail in third. Mauritius Kestrel has got every chance, turns for home in fourth position and about three lengths off the leader. Then comes Crimson Comet further back to All Out for six. Next best is stated, the Aquamarine Colours making its run nearest us. Gnarly's been asked for an effort. Then comes Happy Days. Further back then to Wood World, Priceless Pearl, and War of Hearts as they now reach the final 300 metres. Sound of the Sea, Stated, and Mauritius Kestrel in between them. Turbo 20, La Vida Loca. Then comes All Out for six as Mauritius Kestrel now puts his best foot forward. Shot a length clear in second place as Sound of the Sea, but Mauritius Kestrel is going to go on and win. Mauritius Kestrel, the winner. Second, Sound of the Sea. Third got tight. All Out for six is involved with Stated. It then came Priceless Pearl and War of Hearts. So the winner is racing two off the left-hand side. The blue sleeves and the red cap. That's Mauritius Kestrel. Everything went right for him. He was given every chance. Uh, the pace could have been a little bit better, but it wasn't. But none of that really matters if you're a supporter of Mauritius Kestrel, who wins race number two here at Hollywood Bets Kenilworth and wins it well. Gareth Wright Road, sound of the sea, nice improvement over the ground? Yes, lovely, lovely run, you know. He's a nice individual, he's maturing, he's still blowing quite a little bit. But uh, I think he'll furnish up nicely from this. Uh, you know, that uh, the favourite actually shot past me quite quick because I was going through my paces and caught him a bit flat, but he started to find again late again. So, promising run, so you, you improve with every run. Shouldn't be in the maidens for too long? No, no, absolutely. He gave me a, quite a decent feel today, so he should be winning soon. Gareth, thanks very much. It's Gareth Ryder, right, sound of the sea. Quite a nice result, certainly follow him. Louis M. Totwa, rode the winner. Mauritius Kestrel. Louis, good draw. Found yourself in a nice position? No, 100%. Yeah, I'm As you said in the pre-interview, I um, don't really want to be on the fence, so I kept my options open, stayed one off, and the pace was honest enough you know, for the youngsters. And I just waited a bit of my time, and when I asked him, it was instant. Uh, I won a very good race. Um, it's quite a nice horse, very young, lots of scope. Yeah, I think it was it and second is pretty progressive, so this form line could hold up. No, 100%, you know, they're all progressive. I saw the third horse also in the ring look quite nice, and uh, you know, I just shot past him too quick. At the end, he was coming back at me a little bit. They're all nice, nice young horses, um, you know, looks like we're going to have some competitive racing later on. Yeah, but 61 for Sporting Post this season, you're going for 100 this year? I can't hear you. 61 winners for the season, you're going for 100? Yeah, listen, we've still got four months, so why not? Louis Kotwa, there goes his cap. It's Louis Kotwa, Mauritius Kestrel. This wind is really picking up here, and we'll find out a bit later if it's going to change. We're going to go to the... Brandon's got the winning connections. Thank you very much. Thanks, MJ. Well done to Louis Mkotwa. Of course, a big well done to Brett Crawford and to Mr. Gujida, son of Verse and Getrix, a maiden no more. He's won impressively this afternoon. Great to have Barry with me. Well done, Barry. Obviously, a horse that's done everything right. Um, probably a bit unlucky last time out. Not sure what was running through your mind and through the boss's mind, but um, he was clearly found the right field today and won a good race. Yeah, you know, we, it was really close last time, and it took them ages to separate the two horses. Um, he did everything but win on the photo. But this day, we got it right. Nice, patient ride by Louis. Um, and I always thought it had the beating of this field. Um, so just well done to, to McCunt and to Hull Stable. Um, yeah, and well done to the team. You've got quite a few runners today, Bear. I'm not going to keep you here for as long as that because uh, we'll be here all afternoon. But I do want to pick your brain with that horse, Cliff Swallow. What are you expecting? Well, I... I, th I put Cliff Swallow pretty much in the same boat as this one, you know. Also, couldn't get a clear run last time, um, and we were really quite confident he would win. So, barring there being any surprises, we do fancy him to win. 
Okay, well, that's positive news. I'm hoping that you'll have a double and maybe even a few winners through the afternoon. If you don't mind, Barry, we've got a 100,000 Rand check to present to you. So that'll go a long way to Mr. Gujarat and, of course, to the boss himself. And maybe he'll even throw a bra for you guys back at him. Who knows? Also, big thanks to our sponsors, Hollywood. Thank you very much. Yep, there we go. Barry Donnelly, thank you very much. 100,000 Rand. Thanks to both Tammies at hand to hand over that 100,000 Rand check. That's race number two. Very impressive was number three, Mauritius Kestrel. There, Brett Crawford, Mr. Gujeda, bred by the Berlin Stud Farm. He's won a good race today and definitely also we're going to put into the black book with further improvements. Race number three kicks off today's PA. Ladies and gentlemen, our Hollywood Bets winning groom for race number two is Mr. Professor. Clearly, Professor is educating everyone here and on how to win a race with Mauritius Cristal. Massive congratulations to you, Professor, as well as the Brent Crawford racing team. Professor, you said to me that, you know, you're actually from Valcom. You know, I resonate with that as well since I'm from a small town in Bethlehem as well. Tell me, Professor, how do you feel? Kujuang. Uh, I'm just asking him basically how did he get into this horse racing industry um, and in the history, yeah. I'm just asking Spider or Sibet Mr. Crawford? Yes, I'm a Sibet Okay, and then Dreza, Mauritius Christel, keep a real high appeal. Keep a real high appeal. Keep a real appeal. Straight. And how long have you been working with Mr. Crawford for? I think it's six months or so, I think. And why is the industry in the industry and how about groom? Why enjoy it? Yes, I enjoy it. Yes, I enjoy it. Yes, I enjoy it. And then Dreza, Mauritius Christel or Nana, it's a winner race. Thank God. I give only one. I give only one. I'm going to give only one. I think God. Just to summarize that for the viewers at home and the viewers here on course, wow, what a story. This young man is from Valcom. He has a, an uncle that also works for Brent Crawford. His name is Spider, and that un his uncle put him in the industry. He's only been working for Mr. Crawford for about six months now, and he's really, really, really enjoying it. Uh, he's saying this is his food, this is his engine, and this is his heart. He's really, really enjoying the sport. And I asked him if Mauritius Cristal is going to win many more races and he just said, Sia, just wait. I expect him to win many, many more races. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen, here for race number two. Let's please go watch that replay one more time and then head over to race number three.